It's the 10th annual VW bus get-together in San Pau Pescador near Spain's Costa Brava. And here you can see old and new VW buses, high and low VW buses, colourful and black and white buses. There are rare and not so rare specimens, some with high tops and pop tops, some made of rust and some of canvas. Test driver Mattis Kurat is in his element. Some of these buses have come a long way to be here today. Mattis came down to Spain from Germany through France with a group of VW bus fans. That was a distance of nearly 1,400 kilometers, mostly on country roads. There are VW buses from the 1980s, 90s and current models. But the star of the show are VW California camper buses, which turned 25 this year. VW buses are notoriously sluggish. Even the turbocharged 1.6-litre diesel in the T3 series only manages 51 kilowatts of power and a maximum speed of 127 kilometres per hour. Drivers of the newer buses here agreed to keep to this limit as a gesture of solidarity. This time, the rain in Spain fell mainly in the mountains, but only for about half an hour, and not enough to block the spectacular view. Volkswagen has been building campers since the 1950s, but it's become increasingly expensive and complicated to outfit them. So the Westphalia's interior was simplified, and VW tossed out many of the extras to create the California. After nearly three days on the road, our group was getting close. We crossed the Eastern Pyrenees and headed south toward the Mediterranean. abandoned customs houses across the border to Spain. Since it first came out in 1988, the California has remained much the same. The first generation, based on VW's T3 bus, made a hit with its versatility. It was a practical workhorse and much more. Even with the built-in kitchen, it still slept up to four people. In the 1990s, VW introduced different versions of the T4 California, it even included a built-in toilet, the first VW camper to have one. The interior's versatility and ease of use have remained unchanged. The current generation of the VW bus, the T5, has been on the road since 2003. A few useful gadgets have been added to the California's camping features, such as the folding chairs stowed inside the tailgate. There's lots more storage, a mini kitchen, and still room to sleep four people comfortably. Test driver Martis Kurat assumes the VW T5 would outclass the other buses in almost any category. It's faster, more powerful, safer, more comfortable and takes less fuel. But there's one category where he says the VW T3 California wins hands down, and that's the cult factor. It'll take some time before even the T4 achieves that cult status. The last of the rear-drive T3 VW buses were long something of a laughing stock, but now they too have their hardcore of devoted fans. 